Hey guys, good morning. It's your boy JR14. Hope you guys are ready for this banger. It's another video, another day. This one's going to be awesome. Uh, has nothing to do with the with the accord. I promise you. I know you guys have been feeling the accord. Some of you have been feeling the accord, but I know you are really to get back into that Project Mark Seven mode. Weather's getting a little nice. We back outside. Project Mark Seven back outside. Now, what we're gonna do today? I'm sorry, the camera's so shaky. But what we're gonna do today is the GTI. Project Mark 7 is about to get a whole new turbo back exhaust system installed on it. So without further ado, let's go. All right guys, we here, it's time. <laughs> My boy Kevin ain't working on the car today. Hi guys. Your, your boy's working on the car today. Yeah. I'm just borrowing his, his sure. boot for the day. Right now, got some stuff from my guys over at Integrated Engineering. Kick it over to the side too. <laughs> That's all we got back here. All right, and this is where the party's gonna get started, guys, because now we got. I hope he knows the install's gonna oh, be man. more money than me holding the camera. We got one, we got two, we got three. Here's the help. Bum. I'm not washing this and shit. Four. So today, we're about to get busy. Must now, be nice having a JR money. I got no life. So I just spend my shit on cars, you know? But I'll say this though. Why is that stock? If you haven't seen that video, click in the upper right hand corner of the screen to understand why that exhaust is back to stock. But you knew it was gonna keep the stock for long. We know we're gonna go back to the shenanigans. Something cool about this exhaust, this is not your typical cat back. ECS now makes a brand new exhaust to the Mark 7, which is titanium. Oh, you got money, money. So, I don't have money, money. I really don't. Look at the cuts, look at the welds. Right, it's let me it's gonna a, change colors when it gets hot. Let me get a close up of this. Woo! Get that on the back. So, first of all, I wanna give a special shout out to ECS. I appreciate you guys for sending this out. I'm really curious as to how this sounds. There's not a lot of systems out, especially for this car in titanium. Yo, can I get a sponsorship? I need MP sure, parts. Sure, Volkswagen. You have a BMW. ECS, they ECS. They can't if sponsor you it, me? Turner, Turner Motorsports, ECS. Help on my boy, Kevin. He's been making this Project Mark 7 fast. Felipe officially made it fast. I Felipe do officially bolt -ons. made it fast. Felipe built. So ECS for his E30. And yeah, over there, over there. That's the How do you zoom in? You know, I'm just thinking about just getting it, bro. No, 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 no. no. Let me do that. Yeah. Don't do me like that. Just <laughs> make Lily. this man quit. <laughs> no. Oh, I like the hair, though. Yeah. Felipe built made me go fast. Kevin just basically keeping the car, making sure that it doesn't keep breaking. Or New York not liking me for certain things. But we're not going to discuss those things right now. But this is the tailpiece. I'm not going to go into specifics, but we're going to lay everything out. Uh, lay everything out on the floor and we well not on the floors this is money so Ooh. i wouldn't um put it on the floor now now do i get the bmw's man approval do i <laughs> I, I don't like know it. i don't know it's decent looking see to impress a bmw person you have to do this <laughs> <laughs> Look at this, shit. this is dope this and this is dumb light is it really what? Yeah. hold on i'm holding the camera all right, hang on hang on hang on it's all right we're gonna keep that live hang on. wow <laughs> look at this shit <laughs> I the whole exhaust, like bro, the whole exhaust uh -huh. is 16 pounds. The whole exhaust is 16 pounds. Titanium. Full. 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 I hope it's not no Chinesium. What a bad thing. ECS, so I'm going to back you guys up right now. They make this in-house. They have the titanium in-house, and they fabricate every single exhaust system in Ohio Yo. to ship it out to you guys. Yo, let's take the torch. Burn the whole shit. No. Turn it blue. I want to naturally make it blue. Oh. They don't have the titanium tips yet. Wow. Don't drop it. That's that section. I'm curious, so this has to be the muffler and everything else. Yeah. And then here, I forgot what uh, is in this box. It's a full cap back. Now, we're going to unbox everything, but we also, considering the fact that I had issues with New York, we're actually going to do a high flow cat on the car um, and everything else. That's how we're doing it. March 28th, you know, that's what I'm saying. So it's March 28th. We're doing an exhaust. It's great, it's fabulous, it's gonna be fantastic. And I'm ready to show this car out and be outside this season. 
I don't know if he's ready to be outside, but I'm ready to be outside this season. Felipe ready to be outside this season. Gio got motorcycles and all this other bunch of crap. He going to be outside with something this season. Yeah, my bicycle. Teddy going, yo, Teddy coming outside too. You know what I'm saying? Yo, matter of fact, you going to go outside sideways. You want to see what my man's got over here? This man's ready. This man's ready. Shout out to Tyler Street. You guys are a sponsor of the channel, and I appreciate you guys for helping out my boy. Felipe, you didn't help him out, but you know, yeah. this guy drifts no, more than no, me. He day. will shred more ties than me in the year. Probably. I mean. <laughs> yet? Nope. Not yet? No. no. You got, you got a, gonna be the one thing you need for drifting is a tire sponsor. You got that. Yeah. No, I don't have a sponsor yet. Oh, Gio's talking quietly over here, so we're going to move this way. We're going to go back over this way. But, all right, so we're going to do a high flow cat from the guys over at Integrated Engineering. They, bet, they pretty much have the highest quality of parts my opinion yeah they're good they're really really good when it comes to their aftermarket components you guys need tunes i already have the carbon fiber intake i already have their built motor block they don't make it anymore but and they also now now i will have their high flow cat made it made it to this beautiful titanium exhaust i'm excited this is every time he works on this car this is how he looks no i don't want to go catless just yet so here's the idea now everyone's asking me what was the exhaust system before a lot of you guys asked me that question the exhaust system before that i had on here was an ma performance catless downpipe made it to a corsa catback exhaust don't ask me in the comments how much are you selling it for i'm not selling it it's not sold already the corsa catback is discontinued so i don't want to lose that exhaust i really still like that exhaust and if i ever want to go back to it i'll have it the Catless Downpipe, as you guys know, no one sells Catless Downpipes anymore, so I'm keeping that as well. So the exhaust system, from previous exhaust system on Project Mark 7 is not... It's like, yeah? it's like holding a fucking... Mm, excuse me. Head. No, no, I'm going to put that in here. I want your... It's, it's like holding a can of Coke. Dude, lift the box up. No, this but, is the muffler. No, the crazy part is my coffee's heavier. <laughs> <laughs> I shit you not. How much do you think the whole exhaust system is a catback system with a muffler? And how much do you think no, the whole exhaust system? My coffee's heavier. <laughs> He's so amazed. That's incredible. Good shit. How much do you think? How much do you think the exhaust weighs? Total. Total. Front to back. Tur turbo back. No. Uh, catback. 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 Fifty pounds. Sixteen. 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 With a muffler and everything. Or with the muffler and everything. Wow. We outside, boy. Sorry, Rock NYC. I had to steal up from you real quick. What? How do you say movie in Spanish? Polic Policlia? How do you say it? It's about to be a Policlia. <laughs> how do you say it? <laughs> yeah, I'm, 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 Policlia. I'm learning, yo. I'm learning. I'm going to be out in the heights this year, yo. I'm telling you. It's going to be a movie. I'm excited. I'm really excited about this. What a, even though I did all of this to the car, exhaust systems just happen to be the most favorite thing. Because it changes the personality of the car, in my opinion. Now, the tips just the tips on my course of cat back we did on my course of cat back we did uh we did these black diamond tips so ecs has titanium burnt tips but i don't know if they included it in this kit because i definitely don't have those tips i actually ordered carbon fiber four inch tips which look good they don't look cheesy in my opinion they actually do look really good sorry kevin i already have to make them work I'm sorry, I have to make you jack up the car to put the car in the lift. So, question. I might take fucking take mine off. You're gonna take the burgles off? Yeah. On the Mark Six off? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Why? Why? <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have a two step. Wait. Yeah. Round of applause for Yeldi. He's becoming a man. Yes. You're growing up. <laughs> Look at me. I went from catalyst to high flow cat. I'm growing up. I don't want to smell like gas anymore. But I'm not going to lie. For track use only, when I, when I have a track day, I will swap the downpipe out for a catless downpipe for track use. That's what it's made for. So on track, I will run a catless downpipe with this titanium exhaust. And when I'm on the street, I will run a cat on the car. Have I tickled your fancy yet? I know you've done a lot of different things to this car. What? When it comes down to, like, you know, fixing things and changing things. Have I tickled your fancy yet? Well, we're going to see after we've... Up the I'm curious to see how it fits. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So it is. That is. That is an important piece. How it is the exhaust going to fit on the car? I think, considering the fact that they had their own Mark Seven, and they did the laser development of everything on it, I think it's going to fit well. I have no issues with that. Um, 
I'm excited, guys. So we're not going to do a full installation process, but I am going to show you a little bit of the pieces. Once Kevin is done jacking up the car and getting it on the lift, we're going to crack open these boxes. We're going to show you what's inside. And it's about to be a poliquia movie, if you didn't know. He's not Spanish. Kevin's not Spanish. So poliquia means movie. No. What it? Pelic, pe, pe, what? Peli, kula, peli, kula, peli, kula. Hey! All right, got the nice foam padding. All right, make it show. Ooh. Matter of fact, lay it over here some shit. So Bro, can this is the muffler. This is the muffler. <laughs> <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. We gotta get the thumbnail. We gotta get the thumbnail. So let's. Ooh. Oh boy. Wow. All right, we're gonna get the thumbnail. I think the ECS prints their logo on the bottom. Ooh. Yo, look at this shit, one hand. <laughs> For the muffler, yo. I could never do this with my Corsa. I'll have to tell you, be like. But it's like this, one hand. That's wild. <laughs> that means I jerk off if you really didn't know. You know, woo! Woo! Beautiful. All right. So no. we have the muffler, we have all the connectors here. They don't use V-band. Oh, this is exhaustive. You stupid. Check it out. <laughs> and the last box, so we have another box here. Going full JDM in this place. So Kevin has to give me this back, but I'll make your life easier. Do you have one of these? No, 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 I mean, no, no, I'm not giving it to you. No. Yeah, look at that. No, because if I need to, for whatever reason, if I have to go back to stock. All right, so these are the tips. They don't have the titanium tips yet, so. Get a little bit of carbon fiber. Oh, that's nice. It's nice. That's subtle, nice. Subtle, really clean, four inch tip. Once all the black soot gets in here, it'll, it'll, I was gonna paint that. One thing, one thing I'm just like, I'm not a fan of the ring that's chrome. I may just take spray paint and like put index cards around this and just spray it. I may do that. Just spray the inside, like just th stuff the yeah, cars yeah. in there and just spray it because I don't like that. But it's gonna get dirty eventually. It's gonna get dirty eventually anyway. Alright. Now hold on a second. There is downpipe. Downpipe? Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, these are the these are the other pipes that go towards the back. More light. <laughs> Damn, look at it. those welds. Money. Those welds, though. Alright, down pipe, down pipe, down pipe. Down pipe, bro. Here we go. Now this is not titanium. And you can feel the difference. <laughs> <laughs> so, shout out to the guys over at Performance, or Integrated Engineering Performance by IE.com. So this is their high flow cat, 200 cell. It'll do alright. I mean, for the quality though, as fun as you guys know, I've had a lot of different downpipes before. I mean, performance, I've had uh, circuit works. Um, I've even looked at CTS and stuff, but I honestly really haven't seen anything that looks as good as this. He looks fucking he shiny. Looks mad, but he knows he can't be upset. <laughs> he knows I did too good here. Right, Kevin? Yeah, I like that. He likes it. It's a Volkswagen part. <laughs> All right, wait. What's up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just gonna get. Okay. All right. So, Kevin, what are we doing, Kevin? Uh, I'm about to put the downpipe in. What kind of downpipe is that, Kevin? Rough. You didn't have to look. <laughs> no. I don't like it. Yeah. Should have went careless. No, actually, you done PM4s on car. No, the first one you did PM4. was on my car. I, yeah. No. I on did. a Volkswagen. I did um slow speeds one. Right, but the first time you installed a PM4 in a Golf was my car. Yes. So, now like I said, it's a 200 high flow cat cell cat. Now for track use, I am gonna go back to Catless when I'm on track. I am going on some track days this this year, and I will be doing Catless downpipe with this titanium exhaust on track. Gonna do it. I am. I'm gonna. It's actually not that hard to take the downpipe in and out. Um, I wonder if you have a lot of problems with this. 
I mean, I did the what? Yo, you need to go back to the basics, bro. No, I did my down pipe myself back in the day. Yeah, this cold start is ridiculous. Cold start. So now he's how far did he? Oh, he's right there. Ooh, that looks good. That looks good in there. Looks really good, you know. Performance, integrated engineering. Guys are great. Ready for some track days so I can teach these M boys how to really drive on track. Hey, Gio, are we going to do HPDE events this year? HPDE, high performance driving experience track days together. Are you gonna Are you gonna do track days in your M3? I want to. You bought T37s. It's a show car. It's a fucking. It's a fucking yeah, they are heavy. They're mad heavy. Yeah. So you're not even gonna try to track it. Oh, it's a not once. It's a fucking garage queen. Oh my god. Once a week. That's it. Yeah. Don't get it. And this guy's stock. He's basically stock and won't put his car in a track. I live in New York. I can't modify my vehicle. That has nothing to do with you going on track <laughs> and driving an M3, which is built for track use. He hasn't done rod bearings? Oh, oh there it is. There it is. Uh-oh, uh-oh, here we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just remember, my car has 50,000 miles That don't mean shit. Less than yours. <laughs> that don't mean nothing. It's how it was previously taken care of. I'm a Just because a car looked clean. Just because it has dining on it and it's clean when you pick it up, don't mean it was taken care of. Anything could have happened. Yes, I know. Previous owners and shit, I don't know. But I'm planning on doing it too. Soon. Take Soon out. ain't gonna help yeah, you, bro. No, he had, he's building a race car. Oh, yes, that's right. That beautiful E30. That beautiful E30. It's turbo. It's gonna be boosted? Is it really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Now, then you'll eat my life. Sure. Than a wolf. You add me for that. Oh, 100%. I will give you the credibility for that. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah. 100%. Yeah, we'll 400, 450, stock block. Alright, I'm definitely going to have to do flex fuel on this thing. <laughs> this guy always comes in and like always recognizes me. If it's here or if it's somewhere else. Yes, sir. But you get him on camera, he don't, he's. You yeah, good? Sure. <laughs> Yo, I'm a TT, man. TT and Audi A4. Oh, man. This, yes, guy, guy, this guy has a beautiful, if beautiful it wasn't for couple him, cars. I'll give you a shout out. If it wasn't for my man, I wouldn't know nothing about this shop. I got on YouTube a while ago, one of my boys turned me on to him. I was going through mad stuff with my, my mechanic. Yep. Once I found out about my man JR, next thing you know, I came and met, you know, European Auto, this the GO, yep. and that was it, man. It's been a love, it's been love ever since. One love, y'all. Yo, see, you see? It only took me a blown motor to, to help everybody else out. <laughs> but at the end of the day, it's nice to know that we have a built motor, it's safe. And now we're just, now we're just making some things a little sweeter, right, Kevin? Yeah. Right? Sure. And lighter. And lighter too. Man, we're quick. Man, we're quick, yo. Look at that IE in there. Look at that IE in there. Get that light on it. Ooh, the jewelry. It's like a glove. Like a glove. So, all right, I'm gonna let this man lift this car back up so we can get this titanium. Titanium, one more time for the one time. Titanium exhaust. <laughs> titanium exhaust on this Mark 7, y'all. I'm excited. It's gonna sound. I'm really curious of how it's gonna sound because the metal's different. I heard the, the exhaust sounds different with the titanium. It, yeah, that's, that's exactly what I heard too. So, again, I really haven't heard a Mark 7 with titanium exhaust before. It may have a little bit of raspiness to it or because of the metal center, but. We about to see. Kevin, what'd you break? Sticker. <laughs> I, I, I can get that out. All right, so we got pretty much just the tips. Tips are pretty even. So, we got all this mounted up. ECS muffler here. Now here's the fun part. So we're trying to figure out, this is if you had a stock downpipe, made it to this. But we don't. So we're just trying to figure out the next best thing, right? Right, Kevin? What seems to be the problem? Uh, Explain let's... to us. Explain so, to the fans. Before the install, I asked you if you um, confirmed the ECS if this would work. But I might... And I said no. So. 
Because they probably use the stock something. cap back on their car. The stock so down cap. We're gonna have to use the integrated engineering. Um, whatever the fuck this is, right? Yeah, you're gonna have to. And mm -hmm. then size it down. Size it down. Uh -huh. This one here. Is that a work on that? Huh? That will work on yeah, that. Yeah, basically. And okay. then maybe in the future we could get a three inch. Get this to work with that. Let me Leave it on. Okay. So it's basically like. <laughs> It'll be like this. All right, so we don't have to chop much off. No, no. but future in the future we could probably do a three-inch adapter or some shit right yeah. here. Yeah. Okay. So, because I don't like doing this sizing down the exhaust because you lose torque. Right. But right now we need it. Let me ask you this question: okay. Would it be wiser to use that pipe? That one is too long. It's too long. Yeah. Got it. And we don't want to cut up the titanium. No. Kevin don't want to cut up the titanium. <laughs> All right. So my boy Kevin here. Kevin killed it, as he always does. We uh, got this bad boy, and he's got to tighten these down. Got the ECS logo right in the center here. You look at look at the, look at the guy with the precision. Why? Well, yeah, oh my God! You you taking? You got to buy the expensive stuff for him to take care of it properly. No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. BJ is gonna do a sick. Livery on the car, right? We're gonna do some vinyl cutouts. Yes, that's a yes. I'm sorry, I, I was I didn't see that, but let's take a walk through real quick. We got the carbon fiber tips, however, I am going to be replacing the tips with the titanium tips. Oh, oh, so we got all the nice cuts here, here, going all the way back. Really nice fit and finish, all the way to the muffler. Just nice and solid, it's not going anywhere. All the way down to that IE downpipe. Still gotta tighten this. Oh, he knows, okay, cool. And obviously I can't take you all the way up there. Oh, it's right there. Ah, uh, no, you can't see that. But yeah, I'm really curious to how it's gonna sound. It's gonna be quieter for sure. You think it's gonna be quiet? Down pipe. Wait, 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 wait. What do you think? What do you think is, I mean, we're not starting yet. Wow. I haven't seen you on a channel in a while. <laughs> he miss. He knows he misses this. <laughs> I do not. You do. I run away from him. I freaking miss you, my guy. I blocked him on YouTube. It's true, guys. I blocked him on YouTube. Remember the last time we seen him on a channel? Or? What's up? We're about to start it. I we're follow, about to start it. All right. I follow slow speed only. Wow. <laughs> He's a thought. He only likes dads, dudes with money. <laughs> I got a little bit Yo, of comeback. Gas prices is high. We gotta make money somehow. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. That's how you conduct business, right there. Just do it. <laughs> he lucky he ain't going to Impact this year. He lucky he ain't doing that road racing. We don't want to gap no RS3. All right, uh, guys, are we ready? You ready? Yeah. All right, so do what you gotta All right. do. I got three minutes of tape left. Cross the island. Cross the island. I know. Yep, it's for secondary air injection pump. Imagine. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. Sounds a lot better. I like it. Bass. Got a lot of bass. I like it. It definitely sounds quieter than the cat was, which is good. Don't rub it, don't murder it. Ooh, it smells good. Thank God it's March 28th, 2022. <laughs> Alright guys, so we finished buttoning everything up. You heard the sound clips. We got the diffuser back on. It looks good with the tips. It looks really, really good with the tips. I, li I like it. It looks really subtle, but then when you get under here, obviously the titanium part is covering up in here. Like you can see a little bit of it in here, but this is what it looks like underneath. 
ECS muffler. And you got the straight piece going back. No resonator. And then made it up perfectly to the IE. Uh, the IE um, downpipe. So it's all pretty good. We heard the call what it sound like. Obviously, we have to give some time for breaking. So we got to get some time for breaking for the muffler as well as the high flow cat. Break that in and really would definitely uh, define the sound. Um, I don't know if I'm going to go with the titanium tips. I really starting to like these. These look really good on the car, in my opinion. And it gives it a good look when you look at it from like this angle. You know, it kind of really tames the bottom side of the car, which is all black anyway. Um, and in the future, I may do titanium tips, but for now, these, in my opinion, look really good. All right, guys, so now what we're going to do real quick, we're going to do a cold start of the ECS titanium cat bag exhaust. Made it with an IE from Integrated Engineering hat catted, high flow catted downpipe. So let's check it out right now. some drive-bys and some pulls with this exhaust in a later video. Stay tuned. Take care.